Are you planning to buy a home and don't know where to start? Hi, I'm Alex from Vancouver and today I'll give you the 10 tips to start your home buying process coming up next. Welcome back. If you're planning to buy a home, you must follow these 10 tips. Tip number one, check your credit. A good credit score is essential to buying a home since it proves you've got a good track record paying off past debts such as credit card bills and college loans. A higher credit score makes it easier to qualify for the lowest interest rates which in turn makes your purchase more affordable. To find your credit score, you can go online to TransUnion or Equifax and a small fee may apply. Tip number two is start saving. You'll need cash reserves to buy a home and you'll need to prove to a lender that you can afford housing payments that may be higher than what you're currently paying in rent. In other words, start saving now. You can buy with as little as 5% down. Tip number three, earn extra cash. If you're low on cash as most first time home buyers are, consider taking drastic steps to cut spending or try some ways to increase your income such as selling some of your stuff or taking a part time job. Tip number four, consult a lender. The sooner you visit a lender, the faster you'll know where you stand on getting a mortgage and the steps you need to take to improve your situation. Tip number five is find out how much you can borrow from your RRSPs. In most cases, if you are a first time home buyer, you can borrow up to 25,000 from your RRSPs. If you still don't have enough money, consider asking your family for a down payment loan. Tip number six is, Decide how much you want to spend. A lender can give you an idea on how much you can afford, but you can have to create a personal budget to decide how much you'll be comfortable spending on your mortgage payment. You can go on any lender website and look for an affordability calculator. Tip number seven, ask your employer for a job letter. In most cases, your bank will need this before approving your mortgage. So make sure to have this handy as your employer may need time to issue this document. Tip number eight is start looking at neighborhoods. Unless you already know where you want to live, take the time to visit the variety of neighborhoods. You'll want to scout out the neighborhoods that meet your needs in terms of transportation options and other amenities. Exploring different locations will help you narrow your priorities. Tip number nine, Visit open houses. Going to open houses early in your search will let you see what's available in your area and might fit your budget. You can then begin to see what matters most in your decision. The location, room for entertainment, or outdoor space. Tip number 10 is interview real estate agents. Every agent is different and it is important for you to interview agents that you will feel comfortable working with. Feel free to reach out to me for a free coffee as I can explain the home buying process better in person versus online. So that's it. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up, share. I make educational videos every two weeks. This is Alex from Vancouver and bye for now.